Hello and welcome to the NASCAR Legends series. We are here at Legacy Phoenix and uh, I'm excited. I'm excited for this one. Um, I'm kind of liking how the 87 car drives here. Um, at first it feels like it, it plows really bad, but then you kind of like put the brake bias down a little bit. I've got mine down to about 48% because I don't want to pitch sideways on entry. But if you kind of balance how you're using the brake, you can use the, uh, your brake bias to get the car turning much better and uh, I think it's a fun way to race I'm really enjoying it we'll see if I can pull it off well here in qualifying or if I'm gonna just completely blow it but <laughs> um, once I kind of figured out what the car was gonna want from me I was having a fun time driving around this place so um, it dev it definitely will spin on you on entry especially with uh, the brake bias back so I gotta be careful and uh, during the race, I'm definitely going to be racing differently than I do in qualifying. I killed the tires. Okay, you can take laps 100%, but... Ooh, okay. Lots more grip in the track, it feels like, than the practice session I was in. There must be cooler temperatures or something, because that was a lot less slick than I was expecting. And then as I say that I drift up the track, that was a terrible, terrible three and four. That's not good. That ruins my whole lap. You basically get one lap in this car, so that sucks. But uh, let's try this again. Maybe we can pull it together here for lap two. Get on it pretty good. Fight off the loose. Okay, still a decent turn to one. Okay, back it down more here. Try to get it closer to the bottom. Is this going to be better or worse? So first lap was a 269. This is a 229. That's disappointing. I know I can do much better than that, but that's okay. Uh, my best in the in the practice session beforehand was a 30 0 and uh, I feel like the track was faster here, so I kind of blew it. But uh, that's okay. It's a long race, and uh, it's certainly more than one lap long, so we're going to be looking to have a long run pace for the actual event, which hopefully we'll get plenty of long run. It is a unfortunately single split, I think. Doing a race as soon as I got home here on Tuesday. And uh, it's looking like a 1.8k strength of field. We're down to fourth. You can see some. Uh oh, I'm looking at the standings instead of the racetrack. I'm getting sideways. Um, let's see. We've got the times up there. If I if I managed to get my 30, oh, that would have been a pull time. But also, it's expecting a little much of me to just pull out my uh, best lap out of my hat. Though it stinks because that uh, the first corner on that first lap was looking good, and then I just totally overdrove into the final corner over here. I needed to uh, get on the brakes a little harder, but still balance, not pitching it into the corner, and then enter a little lower, I think. But with the way these cars drive, it just loses all grip after the first lap, so... Essentially get one, one chance for a fast lap. Not concerned, though. I think we'll be just fine. As long as we can survive the start, there definitely could be some guys overdriving and uh, doing some bowling if we're not careful. I mean, there's not much I can do about it if someone comes plowing in from behind, but it's easy to overdrive it and then suddenly you're sideways and there's nothing you can do. But I uh, hope you don't run into anybody. Your lap times will be deleted until you refit the car and try again. But looking like we should be able to hold on to this. P4 starting spot, unless the 16's got something for us. Or maybe the 17 coming in late. So he's got to hurry if he plans to race in this one. So we are, are Unfortunately, we are the uh, number one car with our 5.5k I rating. We've had a, a tough couple of races recently. Um, lost a bit, but also just racing new cars. And uh, even if I feel like I'm finishing fine, my I rating's like, nah, uh you gotta go freaking win the race, win the new car you're learning. And uh, that's not happening, believe it or not. So 
Uh, we're going to wait 30 seconds here since the 17 has not arrived. And uh, this is what their starting lineup is looking like. Hoping it's a good one. So, going to keep my 48.4% brake bias in the car. I think that's a, a nice balance I've reached for me of uh, getting rotation out of the car without spinning myself. So we'll see if I'm correct or not. We're going to go for it. That's the end of the session. Here we Before. are. So 90 laps here at Phoenix. How many laps of fuel do we have? Is this something we're going to have to pit for or not? I know normally short tracks you don't have to pit in this car, but does this count as a short track? You're on the outside this time. Uh, it looks like it's borderline. I think that we'll probably be able to make it though with 89.5 in the tank. I feel like we could save that pretty easily if we needed to. And uh, almost guarantee you that this will not go green the whole way. Unfortunately, but hey, I've been uh, I've been wrong before. That'd be cool if we made it for uh, that long. Only two sets of tires, so we'll have to be smart about when we use those, because tires are definitely going to matter. I think you can get a lot of speed out of fresh tires. So we're going to want to be smart about when we use those. All right, getting started here. Five car on the pole. We've got the nine on the inside. I feel like I recognize that name. He might be like uh, one of Nick's viewers or something. I'm bad with names and all that though. Although even if he, even if it's the same name, there's apparently 33 or more James Wilsons on iRacing. So maybe it's a, a different James Wilson. That's a <laughs> that's a viewer of Nick's. So. Who's to say? Good luck, yo. We'll give a good luck, all. Good luck, everybody. You have two additional sets of tires to this race. Smooth the and have a good run. 78 Fahrenheit, 90 laps. Follow I don't know why I hit my dash zero. up. That's not really needed column. here. But uh, waiting on the three. Doing some. Barbecuing maybe on the uh, on the start finish line. It's like, oh wait, got to start going now. I guess that's the term that they use for when you uh, blow your engine. So that would be confusing for me to say. He was just uh, hanging out there. But we're going now. Old Phoenix. So we've got some grass on the inside down there. No dog legs to cut. Which is nice. I think that would be absolute chaos trying to cut a dog leg in this car. Because you know people would want to do it, and uh, I feel like it would be kind of tough to do in this car. So. Second gear start, feels like. To go green. Stay focused. And gotta be ready now, because this is where the start finish line is here. Back in the past. Okay, okay car is off. Ready. Time to do your job. Right. So you're not really going. Car inside. He's hitting the brakes really hard. Clear. Car oh my outside. god, what are you doing, man? Clear. Why are you slamming Clear on the brakes? Outside. You're gonna get me run over. Much appreciation to the two. Checking up there, cause holy cow, we were going slow. Stay low. There is a car and that guy's going to the wall. Stay low, oh, there's a car on the high side. You're on the bottom, Fuck. three wide. Why are we three wide? Holy smokes. Keep okay, low. three. Dog good, bub. Dog good. You're now three. in third. Keep low. See some guys really overdriving early. Stay low. Looks like. Clear Make high. me a little nervous. Gotta be sure to keep it easy and smooth. And keep the tires on this thing. We have survived the first opening laps, which is good news. Four. The leader has just done a 30.5. That lap time was 30.6. The car in front has just posted a 30.5. Overdrove it a little bit there. Probably want to be a little smoother than that. That 
guy is just gonna run me over. And we get hit a freaking gear later. Shove me into the wreck. I appreciate it. Appreciate it too. Real cool. I knew I was gonna get hit. And a bad week continues. Pit road is now open. Full course yellow. Pits are open. It's not good. You've got damage in various places. Damage in various no, places. I'm sorry. I, I ain't got no steering. So. Well, we'll get it fixed. Get a little bit of fuel too, I guess. Can we go a little faster? Oh, the guy said he didn't have steering. That's right. Um, no apology from the two or anything. That's uh, how he passes, I guess. See if uh, Watch your speed. Pit lane speed limit is he seems to care at all, hour. or if he's just going to keep doing that to people. To get to the end. Pit box team, 10. Can't spend too much time in here, unfortunately. Five, three, two, one. Right here. We can repair most of the damage. <laughs> we can repair most of the damage, I say, but we're going to be in here for a minute 50. If we want to get this all fixed, there's a guy running the wall out there. I don't know what is going on. So in a race I was worried about the low strength of field, it was the next highest eye rating that wrecks me. So guess that says a lot. Turn on the car, please. Move it, move it. Here we can get out in time. They want you in single file. Catch the 17 car. Some really great racing this week, I tell ya. Pits are open. Fix a little bit more. It's fine, you got loads. Loads of fuel, apparently, but I'm not gonna trust that and just top it off. Because I know we're really close. Pit box team. Fill it up. Five. Three. Two. One. So we're gonna go the rest Five of the race here. with damage. Just we what I was hoping for. Our tires are already a little hurt as well. Make sure this car stays on. Okay, go. We don't want to go a lap down here, so next time by. You're on the outside this time. Catch the 15 car. Catch start the gassing 15. it up now, getting around the field. Getting around to the field anyway. Try not to kill our tires catching up. Kind of hard to avoid with this car, though. It's so heavy. Get ready, going green. Single file restart. We'll be caught up just fine. The pace car is off. Be ready. Green, green flag. flag green flag. Behind is pitting. What are we doing? Slow car down low, okay. car stop down low. Car Four inside, teams. you're wow. up top, three wide. You're in the middle. You wanna, three you wide. wanna not stand on the three gas while you're sitting wide. sideways on the track? Still there, inside. Clear. What is this? Inside, clear. Also, what a joke that that was not a caution. Slow car down low. Okay. 
Are we green right now? You're in the top Sixth ten. Place. Somehow, yeah, I don't understand what's happening in this race. Outside. Still there. Absolute still there. parking still lot. Fastest lap for and it's still green. Point four. Clear outside. Six, I gotta pit this time. I guess they're like what? I don't know where that guy went. Sorry, man, you're blinking. I had no idea you were still there on the outside. Sorry about that. You're in five. That was at thirty-one point five. I got a black flag also. How are we in fifth? What is this race? It's now eight point one. Feel bad for adoring the guy on my outside. Thankfully, it was just a zero X for both of us. I am so unfocused right now, I can't even focus on racing. How is that not a caution? That baffles me. There were cars sideways and everything on the front stretch. I'll go high, I'll go. Outside. Thanks, man. I hope you guys can get your labs back because that was a bunch Outside. of garbage Clear that up. that wasn't a caution. It, it completely booted me out of the game. That is strange, man. Yeah. I crashed at South Boston in this I car recently. I just like hit the brake right for the restart, and like literally, my car got stuck. Up underneath him, like I let I let off and got on the brakes as soon as he was on the brakes, and I was literally up underneath him and got stuck. And I, that, that, I don't know. That was the weirdest thing I've ever experienced. Smalley has been disqualified. Yeah, huh. likewise. I went left to get around it all, and uh, of course, you know, it gives me a back black flag, but it pinned me up now. against the Thank barrier, you, and I couldn't get out of it, and all of a sudden it glitched, and stopped, and then booted me. Wow, that's so weird. And by the way, I didn't... I got a black flag, and then I had to serve it again. We got black flags that aren't even clearing? Yeah, I just got dis... Yeah, I just got disqualified. I don't really know how I didn't serve the black flag, but whatever. Same with me. I pulled in. Ah, that's totally bizarre. There's some weird scoring things going on here, it sounds like. I don't know what sort of divine intervention has allowed us to get back to fifth. <sighs> How that didn't, didn't generate a cause, I'll never know that. Okay, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Y'all didn't see what happened on the back track. Patton in front is now 8.6. Oh, tell it. I wonder if the cautions are just glitched now and we're not going to get any more now. Is increasing. It's now 2.0. Nichols has been disqualified. That would be wild. I just got disqualified for ignoring the black flag even though I served it two times. Wow. That last lap was a 31.3. Whoever wrecked on that restart, thank you. Flow guard download. Sounds like this race is cursed. People getting disqualified, even though they're serving their penalties. I keep getting uh, lap time invalid for discontinuity or interpolated. It goes back and forth every other lap. That might be because of the blinking, but who knows with how crazy this race has been already. It's on the second time and somebody ran into the back of me. Yeah, that would make sense. But it keeps happening? Shit. Oh, oh that one counted. <laughs> Yeah, it did it to me on both the races I did last night. It don't really do anything to your timing. I think it just doesn't let them count for the fastest lap if they were. Yeah, I feel bad during that guy. I, uh, I, swear, I looked in the mirror, and he wasn't there, so I thought I was far ahead of him, and then I guess he popped back in <laughs> at some point, and I wasn't expecting him to be there anymore. I don't know, I'll probably look back and he was there the whole time and I'm full of garbage, but... <laughs> Did not intend for that to happen.
I mean, how many people are even left? Because I'm pretty sure, like, so many people got disqualified unfairly. We luckily didn't get... Your lap time was 31.5. A, uh, a penalty. So I was passing to the right side, except for the guy that was stopped who started gassing it up while sideways. I think the guy that did that was the same guy that dumped me too, but I could be wrong. I thought it was like the filter time scheme. Oh boy. Now imagine after all that we're gonna go green now. Good consistency. Keep them coming. I'm still not convinced that the hitting out yellows aren't broken at this point. We might not get another one just because it's not working. Oh god. That guy almost wrecked it. New fastest lap for Wilson, 30.2. Got the guys with the fast laps. Oh, the cautions do work. Well, we'll get caught up. We'll take tires. <laughs> and we'll see what's left I'm of the field. I'm very hurt, guys. Uh, I'm going to try to stay out of the way. Do you all know the uh, low side or high side? Pit road's open. Best if you stay up high. Pits are open. This guy's probably going to have to yeah, go. Not sure if he's going to have hey, much four. ability to drive. Six got to let him by two. What an absolute carnival so far. <laughs> in front is pitting. Really bizarre. Car 13. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. Catch up. Six. Car. Watch your speed limit in the pits. Getting in here. Okay. Take our tires. Pit box in. Ten. Five, More people leaving. Three, two, one. Right here. We can repair most of the damage. Get more of this fixed. Did we get more damage? Or did I misremember how much we had left? See if I can knock off four minutes of this optional repair so I can drive right. I guess we did run into the guy. That's right. Okay. Yeah, sorry about that, man. Why is my car off? I just said eight minutes. My steering was almost 90 degrees left. I was trying to put some throttle into it. Keep it on, but I guess I wasn't doing enough. Oh, great. The two is still here. I thought he got black flagged out of it. Full course yellow. Pits are open. People on pit road this lap. That's interesting. Behind pit in now. Where are we in the field? Looks like we might be fourth. Because the pe person that's listed second place was in the pits. Now he's coming behind us. One left to green. What You're a strange race. All right, Colton, get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. Sorry if I'm blanking, guys. <laughs> Is he? I don't. I couldn't even see. 
I can't tell who's who. You're fine on my screen. Yeah, he looks good. To me. We got lap cars on the inside. About to go green. Looks like there's multiple focus. filter time cars in this race, so I don't know who who we've been dealing with. Post car is off. This is just a race of confusion. Inside. Keep high. Get around the outside. I really don't know how off pace I am or how the handling is because of my damage. Okay, now he's playing. The next car is Patton. Didn't quite get around on the 11. Make sure we break early so as not to run into him. Can this race return to any sort of normalcy? <laughs> Maybe some degree of it. That lap was a 30.7. Took a look. Drove in harder than we did, though. Hold this line. Being extra careful, making sure this thing sticks. I think we're probably missing some speed. Feels like we're a little slower. Hard to say though, we didn't really get very many laps of not broken car in race conditions, so. You've just done a 30.8. Do a little higher here, maybe cut down, get a good run. Man, just not quite getting enough. Car inside. Still there at the bottom. Clear. That lap time was 31.0. Feeling like they're driving away from us on the straightaway a little bit. Just a little bit. Got the check up for them there. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Clear high. He kind of cut us a break there. This car is not handling right. Back in third. Keep hustling. Well, we're third place, um, kind of by attrition, I guess. I'm going a little bit high through the corner.
I think I gotta be more gentle on throttle. I'm getting on it a little bit too soon, I think. It certainly is loose, though. Getting into a rhythm, finally. We've actually got some green lamps going on. And I can actually focus on driving and not whatever strange, bizarre things are happening around us. We got to... Catching up to the lap car a little bit here. Okay, unannounced pit. That's cool. We're okay, we're fine. Scared me a little, but we're okay. <laughs> okay, Colton. Lap times are pretty consistent. P three. Oh, he just leaves. I guess he just wasn't feeling uh racing the lap down the rest of the time. Eleven's hanging in there behind us. Might be that we're overdriving. That could be a thing that's happening. That last lap was a 31.4. Well, I don't know if we're going to be catching these guys ahead. We've got a lot of race to go. Well, I think that wreck at the beginning of this green run was the best thing that could have happened as far as yellow flags are concerned. <laughs> yeah, uh, I guess so. Yeah, the early wrecks usually take out all the green guys that aren't used to running this track. They lost so many people from that penalty nonsense too, which really stinks. It's already a bit of a smaller race to begin with. Completely unfair for people to be taken out like that. Slowly gaining on the seven, just a little bit at a time. I think the five's driving away though. The gap to Borough in front is now one point three. Well, I'm back to having fun again. At least the uh, car's driving well enough. I'm enjoying uh, what I was talking about. <laughs> how I, I like how it drives when you got the brake pedal and you're getting rotation out of it. It's driving well enough that it's fun to drive around here, even if we're not in any battles specifically right now. Your lap time was 31.6.
Pushed a little bit wide there. Still pretty good corner though. Oh, drove in a little bit too hard. Easy now. Hopefully we get a nice good run off though. That's good consistency, keep it up. Overdrove that a little bit. It's a fine line, you lose a ton of time when you overdrive it just a little bit, but if you get up to that line, you can go through the corner pretty good. I need to exit a little higher, maybe there. Okay, Colton, that's half distance. Fuel levels are fine. Not that was a 31 point Good on fuel, I figured as much, but that's good confirmation. I guess we were burning more than I expected. And we're only six to the good. That's not a huge amount, so. We're halfway in the race. Oh my gosh, it's only just now halfway. Feels like we've been racing for an eternity already. That that's all that's happened. Kind of stagnated our charge toward the seven. The caution now would be kind of awkward because we already took a set of tires. Yeah, there's still a lot of laps to go. So would we take them or not? Ooh, that's a that's a tough call. What kind of this middle entry? See how we like that. That's getting a little bit tight on exit though. Not a huge fan of that. Leader getting around some lap traffic up there. Looks like I was blinking a little bit. That was a 31.8. Okay, Colton, your lap times are pretty consistent. Need to be smoother with my inputs. Being a little bit more patient, I think, is giving me more time. The to Borough in front is now 1.5 seconds. That car's that ahead. One's in the wall. Oh boy. That's a little scary. Oh boy, that's scary for the seven. He's having to go in the middle of them. Now it's our turn to get through. Outside. Outside is clear. You've just done a 31.8. All right, one down. We'll get past the 17 next and hopefully not run into him this time. Outside. Stay low. Outside, clear. Here we go. You've just done a 31.9. Still at 1.3 P2, or about there. Looks like it fluctuates a little bit, depending on where we are on the track.
Uh oh. Slow car down low. Not a caution. Go high. The gap to Borough ahead. You have to go full speed still. Your last lap time was a, was a little bit daring at that, but that's okay. You didn't get uh, sideways though, so no yellow. Would have had to make that awkward decision with the tires. I think at this point we have to take tires though. We've gone too long on them. Lap times are pretty consistent. I think they're both pulling away ahead now. Car doesn't even really feel that bad. It's gotten a little tighter, but it's definitely not unmanageable by any means. Ooh, I liked that higher line there. Through the first corner. Does the higher line work over here? I'm about to find out. Uh, I think we lose too much time on entry and through the middle. This line's not going to work if I overdrive it, though. Or is it? That was actually better than last lap because of how much of a run we got through there. Okay, I'm definitely liking the higher line in 1 and 2. Or 1? I don't know what the time but I can never learn what the turns are here. Through the first corner, I'm liking how, uh, how that felt. Uh-oh! He's in the wall ahead. He didn't lose all that much from it, though. We're still too slow. Might be a little bit too patient with the throttle in the final corner there. Turn. It, won't, it won't turn anymore. God damn it. I know that feeling. Car just will not turn. Especially in this car, it can get that way. I think we've been good enough on getting our right rears, right rear into the action, though. Kind of avoiding that feeling for now. Oh, easy now. Almost overdrove that bad. The gap behind has now decreased to 6.7. Gap behind has decreased to 6.7. Oh no. I really don't want that guy to catch me though, because he'll probably rear end me if he does. So. Assuming that is the right guy, I'm pretty sure it was the two. I don't know why I'm taking the high line in, in the final corner again. I already know that doesn't work, so what am I doing here? Looked better that time, but still not good. Definitely some driver error going on here though, because there's definitely laps where I'm hitting my marks better and it's much faster, and then other times where I'm losing out, and that's uh, all on me. I 
I'm gonna catch this guy. He's still 1.6 up though. Don't think I'm faster. Oh. Okay. I did not expect to see that. Why is he pitting? What? The car behind is pitting. Okay, you're in second. Why come though, sir? Do you how do? What? <laughs> That's a weird one. Alright, we're in second place now, I guess. Sure. The app to Jones ahead is increasing. He's it's a 17 again. He did just fine letting us by last time, so I'm not too concerned. We'll give him plenty of room though either way. Is we uh not in too bad of a spot to be careful. I think he's going to drive away anyway, because I think he's got new tires. In fact, that must be why the 7 pit. Maybe he wants tires. Car inside. Clear inside. Maybe the bottom open, because he's going to have freshies. Inside. Clear. Wow, I did not turn up there. I didn't radish either. The lap time was at 32.6. Maybe we get a po to a point where the tires blow, and maybe he got there. That would be an interesting wrinkle in this race. That two might catch me. He's so much faster right now. I'm kind of stinking it up at the moment. You've just done a 52.1. Handling's kind of gone off a cliff. I was talking about how my car feels fine earlier. Now it's starting to get really tight. And we still have a lot of laps to go. That'll be 23 to go. Now, that lap time was I think someone just hit the wall ahead. P2. Underdrove that for some reason. Not sure what I'm up to. Still don't quite understand how we ended up in P2 after getting immediately wrecked in almost two minutes of damage right at the start of this race. A lot of weird things had to happen for that to transpire, but we probably won't be P2 at the end of this one, that was a considering how fast the number two is on his way. Definitely don't think pitting was the right call, though, if the seven was really just going for a strategy call there. I feel good. 27 laps. Yeah, that's fine. That lap was a 32.3. Oh, that's pushing so bad out of the corner. I don't think I can blame my uh, damage on being slower. It might be affecting me a little bit, but I feel like I probably just drove it a little bit too hard. That's probably what's uh, making my handling not so great right now. Plus I'm just not consistent at all. I mean that was almost two tenths faster that lap for no reason. What a strange race this has been. 
Not sure a long green flag run was on my bingo card after the way it started. The car outside, clear high. Catch him at a terrible spot, but we uh, got through okay. I won't have very much fight for the two when he gets here, uh, considering how fast he's approaching. But I probably still will try to hold on to it as much as I can, because frankly I would prefer to finish ahead of the guy who dumped me. That seems like a reasonable goal, right? I'm not going to do anything stupid, but if I can hold on to his outside, or hold on to the spot even, I'm going to try. Oh my god, it's plowing. That last lap was at 32.2. I almost want to put my brake bias further back, but that just scares me a little bit. I'm afraid I wouldn't spin it. Hey, that was much faster. That's good consistency. Keep it up. He's been slowing down a little bit. How fast that he's a, he's catching us. Maybe we will be able to hold on to P two after all. We'll see. So inconsistent, okay, so who, who even going. knows? In the pits. Heads up. 14 to go. Oh my god, it's plowing. In the inside. Car inside. Still there, inside. Clear. You can see how much faster they are on those fresh tires. Pretty remarkable. We lost a good chunk of time letting them go, though. The car behind is reeling you in. The gap is now one really what I wanted. Seconds. Your last lap time was at 32.5. Oh, the car is so bad. It's plowing so bad. He's going to catch us. Thank you, sir. Uh oh, someone's wrecking up ahead. Your lap time was thirty two point You can go ahead. Man, he's gonna get me just like five laps to go, or, or seven or eight, probably. That really stinks. Okay, well, sooner if I do that. God, the car is terrible right now. Someone's Low stopping in the wall. And a freaking caution. They want you in single file. Pit Road is His closed right is now. Jets are in the car. Car number zero five. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Great job. Ten to go. Could have just gone green. I don't know why he decided to stop in the wall over there. He could have just kept it rolling, but he brings out a caution instead. Oh boy. What do we do? Pit Road is now open. Pits are open. We're not going to do two tires. Oh. Hey, leader, what lap are you on? Two tires. Uh, 
Thank you, sir. The leader, Jones, is pitting. Look out for the pit speed limit. You got loads of fuel. Alright, we're gonna put fuel in it, hopefully get some more turn in this thing. We're just gonna take four. Boxing. Ten. Five. Three. Two. One. Right here. We can repair most of the damage. I guess we're just gonna go without repairing the damage unless everybody takes two or something. Because then there's no reason not to take uh, all as much damage as we can. Maybe we'll get a tiny bit fixed. That's neat. That's it, go! Who comes in for fresh the car? Make them last the rest of the race. They want you in single file. Please tell me no one stayed out on the tires. Okay. Thank goodness. That would have been a disaster catastrophe if someone stayed out. Four course yellow. Pits are open. So those guys, the lap cars should go to the back since we're within 10 to go. That two's bumper behind me looks familiar. I thought it was a filter time car that got me though. I guess it was the Sunoco. No, it was the filter time guy that was sideways and I don't think it was the five. I think it was a different filter time guy. I don't know. I was too busy being frustrated. <laughs> pay any real attention to what was the paint scheme of the people I was dealing with. Pretty sure it was the two that got me early though. I have a bad feeling it's going to be an immediate caution from people driving in too hard late in the race here. Next time by. We're going green next time by. This guy is probably going to be confused and not know where to be since they're going to the back. Oh, someone did stay out. Oh my god. Right. Oh, okay. He's not on that old of tires. He's the guy that pit. Good luck, leader. I mean, he's, we're still going to blow past him, but it's not as bad as it could be. Good luck. Green, stay hey, focused. Four, I'm gonna stay low so you can get by. Can't see too well. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, 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 green. Of course I couldn't. P3. Please just stay green. I want to at least get a chance at this. The next car's the leader. Car outside. Keep low. You got five laps to go. Keep it up. We're in a great spot. Still there. Hold your line. Ooh, almost turned the wheel too hard. The next car's the leader. Just holding on out there. Still there. Outside. Tires really Clear. helping in this corner here. Two on his way to wreck me again. I don't know. Could be. Push now. We might win this. You're back in second. Your lap times are improving. Don't wreck it. Uh, the five is pretty darn fast. We've got to be patient with this car. That's just how it drives. Five 
Oh. Why can't we have nice things? Oh well. Good win, five. Alright, we'll finish our pacing. We're under caution. Oh, it was of course the two that wrecked. That wrecked. I don't think I was catching either way. You had it, I'm pretty sure. I'm just glad we had a green run after that bizarre start we had. Pete Road is now open. Are open. <laughs> Topsy turvy world. What flag? What flag? So the seven holds on for third. Depending on where he was, that probably was a smart call. To still go for it there. Yeah, the car is fun to drive still. I agree with him. So at least we got to do that. It wasn't just yellows the whole way. And no uh, crazy penalties that don't go away. Or non-cautions causing pile-ups. Final corner, we'll get our P2, which, you know what, I'm okay with. This was a crazy one, so just to finish, I guess I'm okay, but 8X sucks. Am I finally going to lose my A499 after all these short track races and running into things, being run into, all that, all that good stuff? We'll see, I guess, when we check the race results later. Watch it still glitched and like everybody in the field gets a penalty all of a sudden. Hold on, Colton. Great drive. That's a podium. There's the flag. It's over. Pulling it over. Nice run. Solid work. Catch all right. Car. So tires are just that final run, so not really going to be much to see here. Uh, let's uh, let's go take a look at some of that. Good win, Bob. Whatever you want to call it. So the three gets a terrible start. 3 was really sleeping this whole beginning. I mean, he sat on the grid before going. I mean, just look at this. We're just, like, crawling through the corner. It's like he was in fourth gear from the start. I don't know, and then shifted to fifth gear once he got to the corner. <laughs> I don't know. Eventually we got it figured out, but... Here we go, lap 1. The 17 just gonna smash into the 14. But they're okay, I guess. 18, driving it to the hill over there. Easy to do, and here we get wrecked by the two. Still never got an apology, which really cool of them. Let's get dumped. I mean, I'm, I'm easing it up a little bit because the three is, as usual, going pretty slow through the corner, looking like he's getting loose and going to spin into me, so I'm kind of lifting off the throttle a little bit, though. I mean, lit off the throttle a little bit. I mean, it's not like I slam on the brakes. I'm on the gas, as you can see. But uh, not enough for the two. And then a million years later, we get slammed into. I mean, that caution came out late, too, so, I mean... I don't know if I can even blame them that much. I mean, the caution's still not out, even though I'm sitting on the straight front stretch. Caution comes out now, so... Now they can start slowing down, and I mean, that's a pile of smoke. He can't get by the 18. So, I guess I get it. Cautions are weird here, I guess. So, I mean, I'm sideways for so long. 
Well, probably could have slowed it down a little bit more, but man, I guess I, I should just be lucky that we were able to keep going after this. This is a second place car right here flying through the air. <laughs> so, uh, courtesy to the two for putting me in that position. Fortunately, the 12 got the worst of it because he got the engine damage, I guess. And then the three, who wants to sleep the whole start, decides he's going to just run into the... <laughs> what is this? He's going to just shovel under the nine. And just throttle it up and kill the dude. Like, they weren't going yet. Still not going. Still not going. There he goes. <laughs> He's just murdering the nine. The two goes around the inside and gives himself a penalty and then slams on the brakes, which... I mean... It's a little late at that point. Tense flies in, kills the two. Oh my god, what a disaster! But, I guess, you know what? He's gonna, this guy, the 10's gonna kill the two because there's no caution. No caution comes out. Why? Is it because the pace car's not in yet? Like, what? That's never been a problem before. But, I mean, <laughs> freaking green flag's out right now. We got cars falling into pieces here. I'm all the way at the back, trying to eek my way through. It's green flag, so I'm like, all right, I'm gonna go. The three is there, so I'm going to go around, and then he starts going. It's the three who does it. The three is a bit of a problem, too. He had a rough one. I mean, why are you doing that to me, man? I'm ready to go around on his inside, but he decides he's just going to throttle it up instead of waiting. So there's our other 4X. I was worried that I wasn't... I was on me or something, like I didn't, I wasn't actually going to make it, but no, he starts throttling it up. I was going to be able to get by him just fine. <laughs> but honestly, forget blaming anybody else but iRacing on this, because, by the way, the caution is still not out. What are we doing, iRacing? <sighs> <sighs> what are we doing? Just complete nonsense. And then the three. Is his car broken? I don't know. Maybe that's just how he enters that corner. I don't know what quite to expect from him at this point. Is this what brings out the caution eventually? No, not quite. Three sitting on pit road. Tons of people have penalties. Here's what finally brings it out. So it's the 13 getting loose on exit, it looks like. And then there just happens to be a car exiting pit road because of the penalty. Just complete wrong place, wrong time. Does this bring out a caution? Never mind, that wasn't the caution either. The flagman is still in a coma. Is this the caution? Now it's a caution. This car in the front stretch wrecked is worthy of a caution. The other 38 were not worthy of a caution. <sighs> I don't know, man. Eighteen waiting to get going. The eighteen knows how to do that, the three doesn't. Wait until people are past him. Sorry, I'm being a jerk. I don't mean to be. I'm just not a nice person. I'm sorry. I can't help it. But we are getting started here. Not why it's not sure why it's showing me. I didn't do anything right there. Thirteen is not getting it turned. <laughs> He's spinning out of the corner again. He might have some serious damage or something. That didn't look like it was turning correctly. Five's getting some wall in 49. Sorry, I got the hiccups all of a sudden. Ugh. Got the hiccups wait until after the video. 17's just struggling to get it turned. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. These hiccups. They're getting me good. 
Sterling Marlin. What, ha what happened to the roof of his car? I don't know, but that was, uh, that wasn't a caution, was it? Oh my god. Nope, no caution. Looking for the caution lights. Try to determine whether these are actually bringing out yellows. 17 is having a rough time. He needs to uh, use that brake a little bit more and get this thing turning because the steering wheel is not how it's uh, going to happen. Gotta s slow it down a little bit more than that. Or is having some trouble of his own. The car does get very tight tight in the long run, I will I will say that. A little bit of blinking there, 17 entering the corner way too hard. He's used to that uh, downforce stuff, uh, and then that's when he just stops on the track and brings out the yellow. Which thankfully didn't completely destroy the race by any means, except for the uh for the two, who would have finished probably in front of me. But instead, Rex at the end, I think. We'll see what happened to him. Got 12 going through the corner pretty slow. The 8, thankfully, just, uh, oh, wow. You know what? I'm glad that uh, the 17 stopped on the track, so that way the two could uh, experience some karma. The 7 is my hero. Man. Sucks, doesn't it? What a bummer. Anyway, that was probably the last thing we're going to see, because that ends the race. And uh, the 5 gets the win. Good, good for him, because I didn't see any issues from him. I think he might have even had a 0x. I had a 4x somewhere, but uh, so did literally everybody else. No 0x's in the whole field, so that's a, that's a thing that happened. Uh, unfortunately, we got the 8x, but one of those was getting dumped and the other one was a guy speeding up while perpendicular to the track, so not too much I can do about that. Still gonna hurt my safety rating nonetheless. Or maybe it won't. Maybe we'll still have the A499. We'll look here as we bring up the results page. Thanks for sticking with this one. It was a bit of a long one. Lots of incidents to see and everything, but... Uh-oh, I think I just saw something. After an 1866 strength of field race, we have finally lost our 499 after a week of short track racing and uh, similar events as to what we saw in this one. But hey, we gained some I rating for a second place finish. Only eight, but I've been hemorrhaging I rating lately too, so I'll take it, especially again after doing a freaking helicopter on lap two. So, uh, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take the wins when I can get them. Also, my fast lap time was not great. I'm two tenths off all these guys up here, which is interesting. Hmm. Anyway, that'll do it. Thank you for watching. Um, man, what a disaster of a race. The, the two who gets wrecked at the end there and ends up three laps down still finishes eighth. <laughs> that's a that's a crazy one. So many people out with penalties. Got the disqualifications back here. That is, what a weird one. Really weird race. Thank you for sticking, sticking with this one. Um, very interesting. Bit of a carnival, but uh, five gets the win. Congrats to him, and we'll get P2. So... I'll take it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.